Hi everyone, welcome to Readings by Roxby. So I'm going to do your daily messages for Tuesday, October 16th, 2018. This will be just a general reading for all of you. If it resonates, awesome. If it doesn't, please check out the ones that I post over on Instagram. Link will be in the description box. They're done per element over there. Oh, my subscribers. October 9th, 2018. Perfect. I'm using the, the Lima for you guys. Okay, your central issue, the two of cups reversed. Your foundation is the seven of wands reversed. Recent past, page of pentacles reversed. Crowning you, well, the ace of cups. Moving forward, the Three of Swords. Okay. Well, somebody's definitely done fighting. Like, that. They're, they're just, nobody, you got fire sign energy here. Like, it, I feel like someone's done fighting for a relationship, marriage. Could be a business partnership as well. But unfortunately, it fails. Some of you definitely could be dealing with a water sign. Scorpio, Cancer, Pisces. And, you know, it is a very sad situation. Like, like you're, you're, you know, you feel sad. You feel heartbroken. And honestly, I'm going to be honest, guys. I feel like. This is what was meant to be. Because the Ace of Cups is, this is upright. I mean, so there is so much growth, security, stability that is going to come from letting go. It was, it was emotionally draining you. And it's like, now you're going to be replenished, restored emotionally you know, by God, spirit, your angels. Like you're really going to be, you know, so overwhelmed and full of joy and happiness because you've done the right thing. But absolutely, some of you are really, you're... You're overwhelmed and there's definitely some kind of separation with a partner, a spouse, it could be a friend, a family member, definitely water sign energy, Scorpio, Cancer, Pisces. For whatever reason, this just can't, can't get going. You know, with that being said, you know, the seven of wands is reversed. So this kind of feels like you weren't really fighting too hard for this anyway. And you, for some of you, I really feel like you're fighting for yourself. Like whatever that is for you. Emo on an emotional level. Whatever that, that is ending here. I don't feel like it's actually ended yet. You're in the process of it. And unfortunately, you know, some of you are having a difficult time with it. You know, you're heartbroken. You're disappointed. Or you're having to break someone else's heart. But this does feel so emotional, too. I'm going to clarify with the distant past. Definitely 
want to see what the Ace of Cups is first and foremost here. Ace of Cups. Oh, definitely this one. Whoa. The moon is, is an emotional energy. There's heavy emotional energy here. You notice in this card, the moon is controlling the tide. You, you got heavy Scorpio energy here. Or you could have this, this in, in your, in your, in your chart. Very solid Scorpio. Or you're dealing with a Scorpio and it's all about the truth coming to light. The truth about hurting, the truth about someone hurting you, about someone betraying you, it could be financially with the Page of Pentacles at work. You know, you've been probably, maybe been kept in the dark about something. Let's see the Page of Pentacles. Let's see what that was. Oh, you definitely were kept in the dark. The moon and the high priestess reversed. Oh, yeah, definitely. And it's... With the moon card, it, it, it's definitely secrets and lies absolutely coming out. And you were absolutely in the dark about something. Let's see this three of swords. Interesting. It is the Three of Cups. Now, the, it, the Three of Cups is not always a cheating scenario or a three-party situation. It's about hurt and betrayal. You know, this could be someone even going behind your back. Like at work, breaking your heart, like your business partner. There's too many people in the mix, it seems like. Partnering up, you know, you're partnering up with these other people, you know. And them kind of being excited that you're hurt or being excited that they've moved on. Like it absolutely was not, this was def was not worth any sort of fight. It wasn't worth anything. I do feel like this is almost over though. Two of Cups. I definitely like this one. Wow, it is. The world's reversed. This is coming to an end. Almost. You're not quite there yet, but it's almost over. Look, let me see this seven of wands. All right, the Queen of Swords reversed. This is like you did, like maybe you, some, some of you maybe just didn't want to fight for an air sign, a Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. They didn't want to fight for you. Let me get another one there. Okay, it's going to be this one. And the Wheel of Fortune, they're stuck in a situation that they, they just can't get out of right now. It's like maybe a friend of yours was maybe being attacked or you were being attacked. You know, or maybe you, you know, you were attacking them. And it ended up 
there's definitely something that happened it, it, and it, it, it included other people maybe you were involved but I don't I don't even think you realized that you were because again you're in the dark you did not know what was happening but the truth is absolutely coming out about it I mean definitely Okay, well, the Six of Wands flipped up for the Ace of Cups. So, with this, I think you're going to end up creating a situation really spiritually for yourself that gives you a beautiful new beginning. And it, and it probably even going to, might even allow this friend of yours that's, that's very resentful a new beginning as well. Nine of Wands, you, you will end up fighting for someone in the future. Not right now. So something that you did not fight for before, you're going to fight for someone in the future. Not right now. So something that you did not fight for before, you, you are going to fight for in, in the future, but This is absolutely going to change. Like you have to get rid of these extra people that are in your space, whether this is at work, this could even be in school, business partnerships, but it really does turn out to be the best. Something that really, really, I feel really what is meant to truly be. It is, look at that. I wasn't even going to do that, but that's your, your angels, your spirit guides guiding you on the path that you're meant to be on. Can't make that up. That's definitely spot on for somebody. Definitely going to happen. Not right now. I would say three weeks. Definitely. All right, guys, leave your comments. Let me know how it turns out for you. If it didn't resonate, please check the ones that I post over on Instagram. And I will see you guys back here soon. Take care.